and welcome to Backseat Gamer, the show that asks the question, have you ever seen the rain? I'm your host, Michael Riley. With me is Dane Forgione. Well, first, you know, in the last episode, you asked who would stop the rain. Now you want to know if you can see the rain? Listen, if Creedence Clearwater Revival can ask both questions, so can I. Uh, also, Jason Amherst is with us. Hi. And Ashley Miller. Move over, Brat Summer. It's time for Feral Fucking Fall. It's time Will for Feral Fall. Excuse me, it's time for Fat Boy Fall. It's my time to shine. Yes, because the sunlight is limited. <laughs> my vagina is made of time. Just click Kong's That's enemy. You must be destroyed. Whoa, shit. Let's get let's get this hunk of junk and get out of here. Oh, you got a bounce on the Do I? Rare. Rare. I think Satan's going to sue somebody. What the? There, there's the uh, real enemy head. Oh, my God. That for a, That's pretty fucking terrifying for a Donkey Kong game. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Kill him. That's what I'm doing. Ah. That's what I'm doing. It's like Dixie, Dixie, and little little baby Kongs trying to like dodge and bob and weave all the lasers. It's like weave and bob. Shooting on us, God damn you! And the robots like beep, boop, beep. God has already damned me. The hell is um, that? Sh- uh, I think that's either a propeller for the gyrocopter or a me kind of was. <clears throat> so I'm trying to figure out where the what the I need a cannonball for that one uh, bear in this in this world, right? Yeah. Uh. So. The next place you can go, actually, um, you see on your map there, yeah. you can go to Cotton Top Cove. Yep. Baz's Blockade is the first level of it. Okay. Well, according to this, I'm supposed to actually go to... Hold on a second. Ah, I gotta find it. According to this, Cotton Top Co. was supposed to come first. I'm now supposed to go to K3, but... That's alright. I got it. Alright, there we go. Cotton I Top Cove, let's go. This, this game was kinda sorta open-world-ish. Kinda sorta in a way... Oh, what what does this bear want? He naked. Hi, hello there, Kongs. How are you? My name's Blue. P -p -p Pleased to meet you. What's that red circle on the calendar? Oh, uh, it's nothing of importance. Oh, uh, like a birthday cake or some shit. Oh. Okay, so if you go straight forward, uh, just keep going straight. Keep going straight. Boom. Bounty Bay, nice. This is Bird. Bird, Bird, Bird. Boom! Bird number five. Killing it. Uh, BRB. Killing it, G. Alrighty. Means I'm flying alone for now. Baza's blockade. Let's go. It's a very peaceful, tranquil level. Who else is still on the call with me right now? Who didn't go away? Ashley, are you still here? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm here. Okay. Dane, are you still here? Himself. Okay, Dane. I think, oh, Dane's Dane's here. Okay. 
You mean barely? I uh, just wanted to see what you would say if I said that. Just barely? Yeah, like just, these stone bears. Just, the just stone, stoned barely, yeah. Because, <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, I don't know, Mike was being kind of a meanie pants in the last episode. I'm a little, I'm a little, I'm a little, little hurt. I'm a little, um, a little upset. No, you're not. Uh, okay, I'm not. <laughs> Actually, you're you're from New York. Real... You're from New York. You have a thicker skin than all of us combined. That's right, you fucking fat piece of nuts. That's right. Bing's skin is so thick, he can literally pull it over himself in the winter. Yeah, that's right. It's like a nice um, wool covering. I, I'm, I'm a New Yorker. I'm not a fucking Yeti. <laughs> Though you can, you have been you have been known to be abominable at times. <laughs> wow. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. I'm gonna pretend to be. I'm gonna pretend to be offended again, even though we all know I'm not. All right, I remember. You know what? You know what? Next time you need you need something. Next time you need a, a loan of like a thousand dollars, I'm gonna remember what you said. I've never, really, you know, I've never asked you for money. I don't, I don't, you know, I don't try. I try not to do that because I hate asking people for money. Right, Virgil. Right. Well, no, he asked me oh. for money, and the shit like that is why I don't ask people for money because people have fucked me over on so many occasions after borrowing money from me that I'm just, I'm not, I'm good, you know. Virgil stole from me. Yeah, Virgil stole from me. Yeah, he didn't even ask. And you know what? It's okay to it's okay to name names because the motherfucker's dead now. I mean, I've been naming his name <laughs> for a long time anyway. Like up until that point, up until that point when he stole money from Mike, it was the coolest fucking car ride ever. It yeah, got a little it was a lot of uh, fun. Like it was cool up until you know the, 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 the robbery. I mean, he just he was he blew a lot of smoke about him and they, his days with him and Hogan. Some stories, to be honest, some stories I that I'm probably that I'm honestly sure probably half of them didn't half of it didn't happen. At least I, or how, I can't imagine. I strongly yeah. imagine that most of those wrestlers tell stories of things that didn't happen. Yeah, yeah, man. Me and Hulk, me and Hulk, we saw Fabulous Moolah. She was shitting on a table, man. I mean, oddly similar to that. How do oh, I, huh. how do I, oh, I gotta go under, don't know. Hmm. Can I jump <clears throat> over that? Like, honestly, oh, I can just go under it. Honestly, I would believe... Fuck. See, this is where a two-player would come in, because then one of you could stand on the shield and the other one could hit him from the back. Nope. Nah, you can't actually split up like that. Fuck. I would say if Virgil told me a story of, like... Ric Flair calling him the N-word because he tried to break his arm. I might believe that because wasn't Virgil more of like a collegiate wrestler before he joined WWE? No uh, idea. Not a clue. Well, I so don't... What, what you're trying to tell me is that my joke about a, a person shitting on a table is not that far off from what he said. Not really. Uh, I, I don't think I want to know who the actual culprits were. Didn't he also tell a story about how the Undertaker got him out of like a speeding ticket? Yeah, he did do that. Because it was mostly him talking about that, him talking about his glory days with Hogan, him talking about how he had bitches on his dick all the time. Mm -hmm. But other than that, it's just... It was at tedium 
but it's like we were i i i hate to say it mike we were kind of a little starstruck having a w well yeah i mean he's been on fucking television i don't I mean, how often do you get to meet somebody who's actually been on television? I mean, when I I drove a couple of the old time wrestlers uh, over the last two summers on occasion, helping out a friend of mine, and the it's so funny how wildly different they were because, like, Jimmy Hart did not shut the fuck up for five seconds. <laughs> Can't believe that. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What's going on, baby? Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Greg Valentine. <laughs> Fill me up with your love, babe. Is what I thought. I thought you said there. Greg Valentine did not s- said maybe he said maybe five words. And I, you know what? I really don't want to talk. I just want to close my eyes and relax. All right. Whatever. Well, that's fair. Demolition was kind of in the middle. They were. They were talkative, but they weren't like Jimmy Hart. So, yeah. I swear there's a bonus barrel, but I think I've missed it. Uh, Could it have been like in the background? Like, you know, and... I definitely <laughs> missed it. I've missed everything. Oh, no. I'm sure Jace could even mother- share stories about voice actors who were of the similar vein, like Chris Ayers. That dude, God, God rest his soul, that man could talk, but he was so interesting and so intriguing that he could strike up a conversation with like 15 fucking people at the same time. Oh, Chris Ayers so was a sweetheart, too. Oh, he was. <clears throat> he was. He was an absolute saint, and it's a shame that he passed away, because, like, I feel like the world got a little bit fucking darker. How the hell do I get this? There's no uh... wall over there. Hmm. I can't just hit him. There's can no you, wall to re- rebound you, like, off of. Can you walk closer to him? That, why would that work? Because if you get closer, you could end up like throwing it over his head and it'll bounce back. No. There's nothing for it to bounce off of, is my point. See? Oh, fuck. How Maybe. F- hmm. That's bizarre. Hmm. Oh, God damn it. That's quite a conundrum. Yeah, I'm not exactly sure how to get this one. Uh. Let me see. I. I'm like fast forwarding to the end of a uh, video to see. You know, I managed to give a stand-up comedian a, a ride to his hotel because he didn't have a rental car. Oh, wait a minute. I think I figured it out. Oh, yeah, no. This is a very, very weird situation. You have to... And, and, and I quote, gently throw the barrel so that it rolls slowly and then shoot yourself stand on shoot yourself in that barrel so that you fly over him so he's distracted and it hits him that seems very fucking convoluted yeah no it is it is one of the hardest ones to get in the game really and how basically do you gently, it how do you gently throw it so it's basically as kitty kong it involves like throwing it forward and up at the same time to kind of do a forward like do a barrel roll damn it as kitty kong you can throw it forward and up at the same time which will make it like 
Oh, shit. Three Kong's the big, right? Yeah. So, you gotta do forward plus when you toss it to give it shit. the gentle roll. Forward and up. Although Mike almost had something, doing the bounce off of the, uh... Like, throwing it onto that ledge and then having it bounce. That seemed to almost work, so that could be something. I don't know. Although I wonder if you were to... Hmm. Ah, I'll post the video timestamped in Discord. Yes, now I remember. He wasn't just a stand-up comedian. It was also a, uh, it's also a football player, Benny Ricardo. He was actually really cool too. When I gave him a ride, he was a a place kicker, I believe. Um. Oh, I see what you're supposed to do. See what I mean by how like it's a slightly slow throw when you do it like up and forward mm -hmm. so when you do it that way you do it you get that slight slow throw jump up into the barrel shoot yourself over him oh. so he's distracted and then it hits him i didn't him. even know there was a barrel right there yeah i was like what fucking barrel are you talking about <laughs> yeah i even posted a link with a video like time stamped that shows it yeah, the barrel right yeah, there. That one's there. Nope. That didn't time it right. Ah, shit! Uh, you, uh... It's, uh, you, uh... You landed it on the upper platform, that's why. The upper room? Oh, god if, damn it. If, uh, if the barrel hits We're the upper platform, here. then... Try throwing shit. it from, like... Try throwing it from like just underneath the where you plan on jumping. There you go. Got it. That was a pain in the ass. Now I gotta go back yeah. and find get to the bonus areas because I I've, I've missed all of them. So I gotta go back through the level here. Incredible. There's one. But I'm on the wrong side of the waterfall. Hold on. There we go. Oh, nope. There we go. That was a pain in my dick. Mr. Sunjay. Sunjay. Ah, no. No. Stop. No, 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 no. So now I can say that I've had two athletes that I have driven to places. Uh, a football fuck. player for a comedian and a Virgil. I think calling Virgil an athlete is stretching. But I I remember I remember that he did I think he did that wrestling and was actually pretty damn good at it before he joined WWE. Oh, yeah, right like again. The, the the one comedian that I drove, he was a former football player, place kicker in the NFL for the Buffalo Bills, Detroit Lions. Oh my Northern God, that's Saints, Scott Norwood. Minnesota Vikings and the San Diego Chargers. His name was Benito Concepcion Ricardo, or as his stage Benito. name, Benny Ricardo. His name was Benito Mussolini. Mussolini, yeah, I was getting ready to say it. Not and the blue meanie. But blue Nito Musamini. <laughs> but Cowboy Curtis and John the genie. <laughs> but he he uh he worked. I know that he was a football player. He did stand up comp well, still probably does. And also he was God, this a one's fucking tough for uh, HBO boxing. Oh, that's a lot more to this guy's Because the stars are on every platform. Yeah, but I keep fucking hitting the barrels on accident when I don't mean to.
God damn. Excuse me. Got Your it. excuse. Barely, but just fucking got it. Alright. One more bonus area, I think. Okay. It's up a little ways. I literally can say that Benny Ricardo was a much better uh, rideshare partner than Virgil. Actually, to be honest, much, Mike and Much Mike better were... lover. What? Oh, hell no. No. No, 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 that shit did not go down. It was mainly just a, hey, Ashley, I know you liked my show, and I don't have a ride back to the hotel. Can you give me a ride back so I don't have to call a cab? Talked about his career, and then it's just and, like, okay. I'm and off. in return, and in return, I'll give you a seven-way around the world. No! I am not a chuckle fucker. God damn you. A chuckle fucker? It's kind of like the... <laughs> Comedy World's equivalent of a groupie. The, the, <laughs> wait a minute. That's, that's actually what it's called? Is that it? I really? Believe, uh -oh. I believe so. Oh, was what it. That's how they... A chuckle fucker is a comedy groupie. Yeah, I guess so. Oh. That is just... I don't know why. <laughs> Well, it's it's something that had been around for for since uh, nineteen sixty two. Next, creeping wow. class. So weird thing. Yeah, yeah. It's it's actually from the Urban Dictionary, but it's it's like a term of abuse originally so whoever decided to make it as the comedy club equivalent of a groupie is kind of a fucking asshole i met a little groupie all the way in guadalupe this is a female who has sex with guys who are funny like comedians comedic actors and improvisers it's been around since 2011 ah, so yeah i kind of well, you dated people. me that you are a chuckle fuck Oh no! You're not a professional comedian, Mike. I have There's acted. Wow. I have done improv comedy on a stage. I am a. You are a chuckle have fucker. Have you been on the Joe Rogan Experience? No, but I was on our show that we put on. So. But here's the thing, sugar tits. I was on that same stage too. Yeah. So if you've masturbated, you're so also not... a chuckle fuck. <laughs> Well, I I could say that you're a chuckle fuck because I've been on a stand up comedy stage uh -huh. and have done improv and have done comedy I don't, theater. I don't have a problem with that though. You seem to. <laughs> because when I went to stand up comedy shows, I I didn't want to have sex with any of the comics. I wanted to learn from them. I wanted to learn about comedy because at some point I had a passion to want to do it. But mm -hmm. Most women who, like, most of the groupie culture has kind of, like, died down in recent years, except for, you know, when Joe Rogan showed off his abs, because, you know, some bitches were I thought you were going to say when Joe Rogan showed off his ass. I, I mean, would, I'm that sure would be gonna... disgusting. Probably hairy. Mm, Joe I mean, Rogan's probably... uh, man tits sweat looks like, uh... Anime girl blushing. His ass crack is probably caked and shit. More than likely, but you also have to remember the dude is actually Wait. in peak physical condition because of his, um, uh, like, MMA training. I don't have a barrel to throw at him. Throw the kid. Uh, there's one there. Oh, there, Ryan, I found it. Oh, I was just going to say, throw the fucking kid. I don't think that works. That won't work, because the kid doesn't uh, bounce off walls. That was 
it's an easy level, thank God. Well, sometimes you have to throw a motherfucker to get things done, and I'm sure the kid would have understood if it was a function. He's a kid. Conjunction, I'm not saying that's why. What's your function? Take it in, sperm and spitting out rabies. What? Uh, what? Oh, um, <laughs> uh, what? You know what? I, I think I'm just gonna go cry now. Awesome. No. I didn't know you no. could cry. When I hear when I hear shit like that, it makes me sad. If that kind of shit hurts my brain. If Dean wants to get... cry in the corner of the shower while listening to Tori Amos, it's his God-given right. Ashley, do, do you listen to yourself when you talk? Or do you tune in? Making, uh, I was trying to That's make a lot of a stars. Funny... That's Holy a lot. Shit, that is that's a lot of thrust. Uh, that's way too fucking many stars. The universe is made of stars. We are all made the of stars. The universe farts. is made of stars. And most of them are on oh! Saturday Night Live. Again. Oh, good wow. Night. Good lord, that was so close. There it's like the so third bonus area in a, It's like the third bonus area in a row in which I barely made it. I'm not gonna lie, little man. Little man is just having the time of his life. Sure, it, there's danger afoot, but he is just vibing. He, he's a video game. He, he, he's, 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 he's a video game. He's a video game. Yeah, character. I know he's a video. I know he, he is a video game character, Dingus McCringus. It's just I was making oh, an he, observation that seemed adorably funny. Well, your observations. Are, are, are not, they make me want to fart. Well, that's a you problem. <clears throat> I, I that's can't a control screw your problem. I love you, Dane, uh, but as a friend and yeah. As a trend. Well, as I want you to be. Okay. Take your time. As a hurry up. Hurry up. The choice is yours. Don't, yeah, be, don't late. be late. Uh, all right. Well, I listen. I swear, I don't. Me have too. Gun. Fuck shit. Ass tits. Um. No, that's from the song. I know. Uh, Good. Good. Doing. Turns out he. Turns out he did have a gun act. <laughs> How the fuck do I get this goddamn DK coin? Don't uh, know. All maybe, time maybe the barrel was exit. Oh, uh, two to one. It probably has to be uh, that the uh, elephant turns into the barrel. Oh. So you need to find the elephant. I gotta find the elephant. What is this thing you sent? Well, time to go trunk hunting. Trunk? Trunk hunt. Ah. I fucking love this microphone. Damn it. Damn. Damn. Oh. Damn. What have you guys got planned here in the next few weeks? What do you mean? I'm just trying to make conversation while you're trying to make strategy. Okay, well, I don't... I don't know the answer to the question. Because I don't You could just know. be like, oh, I, I don't... You just be like, oh, I, I don't love love. I, I'm just gonna probably just fuck around a little bit and 
and just and you know, dick around oh. with my technologies. F fuck yeah. around and find out. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Hello, lovey. Oh, there's yeah, an I, elephant I, I, barrel. It's down there. Okay, I see. Let me go All get right. it. Yes. Oh, there are the coffee mugs. Oh, oh there's that an Beyond section. There was a letter that you missed, but that's okay. I don't give you a shit about those. Oh. Those aren't needed for completion. <laughs> nope. Not one fuck was given about those letters. Oh. I can't drop uh -oh. there, apparently. He's like, I'm not here to roast Rob Lowe. I'm here to fuck John Stamos. Like, me That's too, old lady. Not... Me too. No, I don't the, know what any of that roast, means. That wasn't the roast of Rob Lowe, eh? <laughs> that was Bob Saget. I not remember... Oh, Bob Saget. Yeah. Okay. John Stamos was not which... at the roast of Rob Lowe. <laughs> I couldn't remember. I just remember that old ass lady talking about them. Just like, that takes some balls. That takes some balls. It's like, okay, okay, ma'am. Okay, I get it. Holy gonna... shit, you. I believe I can fly. I believe I can touch your thigh. I think about it every night and day. Why is that elephant getting such sick air? Too bad you can't uh, ricochet your. Uh... All right, now here's the issue. How do I now? How do I? What do I do about this? Uh, it's it's got to go along that back path through those. Dudes in the back, and okay, I'm gonna create Ooh. a save point just in case. You can do it, Mike. Put your ass into it. Nope, that didn't work. All gonna be safe, and we're all gonna have a great time. The Jesus Christ is that? Ah, oh, shit. Anyone remember that clip? That was actually pretty. <laughs> My name is Cleveland Fuck. Brown, and I was pooped a clown. I My guess what it had Cleveland. to do with getting through those two dudes in the background. And mm. then what? These humans were never meant to see my happy black guy face. Yeah. Oh, I despawned it. Fuck. Oh, you gotta follow the. You gotta follow it to make sure it don't despawn. Oh. Piss on my fucking face. And tell me that you love me. No, no. Boom. No, I don't fuck you. No. Alright. No, no. Now I've gotten everything I can get out of this level. Yay. Jesus Christ. Superstar. Jesus Christ. Superstar. Superstar. Who the fuck do you think you are? Jesus I don't think those Jeepers, are Jeepers, Creepers, Creepers, Slacker Guy. Jesus Christ, can you tell me how to get, how to get to how Jesus to Christ? Fennel. How, how to, get to get to Fennel, Fennel Street. The bread of God is bread, is God is bread, so God is bread, but is he bagel or sourdough bread? Are you done? Yes. Okay. <laughs> sourdough bread. Just gonna, just gonna. 
Everybody take a fucking knee. I'm just gonna poop a pee. He is early yours, Sven. He is early yours, Sven. Wait a second. Wait a minute. Is there a documentary coming out? No. Never. Well, what's a what's a documentary? Every year, every year several documentaries come out. So the, the, hold on, there's there's something that caught my interest. I have to check this shit out. Is, is it, it the is it the Will McMahon Bell documentary? No. If I watch that, I'm I'm gonna hate fuck something after. No, this is something else. Will Farrell and his close friend, former head writer at SNL, Harper Steele, embark on a co- cross country road trip embark together on a cock after Harper road comes trip. out as trans woman. Cock country and road trip. Woman. Oh, okay, okay. So Will, I guess Will Farrell and his friend, um, Phil Farrell Steele are. Cross country road trip together, and they're going to make a documentary about it. Is heter- him and cool his heterosexual one. life mate, John C. Riley. <laughs> you know, if yep. they did a documentary, I would be willing to watch it. I would be willing to watch it. Like, Will Ferrell kind of gives would me the you... gig sometimes. But... Why Look, is Will there Ferrell are some do documentaries it? I'm willing to watch, there are some documentaries I'm willing to skip. And the ones that I am willing to skip are for good reason. I will never watch the Vince McMahon documentary of my own free will. You literally have to chain me down and fucking force me to watch it and get my eyes pinned open like that one fucker from Orange or Clockwork Orange. Orange. But if it's a documentary involving like a comedian from a show that I like or uh, having to do with like overseas stuff like the contestant or music documentaries or even those one bitches from Grey Gardens yes I will I will watch it willingly okay yes I could just imagine Dane just chaining me to a fucking chair and he's like you could have fucking watched this Vince McMahon documentary I, I no no that that would not happen. Oh. I'm joking. I'm fucking Dane joking. Is, Dane relax. is not spoony. By the way, whatever did happen to that cocksucker? Spoons. Uh, I don't know. Spoony. He farted and fell over. Like, he went to an like he went to an IKEA and he got lost. Yep, probably. <laughs> that does seem to be the, that does seem to be the motif of like most people from motif the, from the channel awesome era. You it's wanted like, a miracle, oh, you got lost- motif, babe. Oh, just imagine if Doug Walker had a sassy black woman reviewer instead of like you know being a piece. Yeah, of Yeah, she like had he had one that the chick with the goggles, and she left because. <laughs> Fuck Doug Walker. <laughs> oh, oh. I did not know that. I don't even remember him having like a, a black woman on ages his ago. roster. It was ages oh, ago. It was... Oh, so this was probably before my time. Okay. Yes, before you were born. Yeah. Mm hmm. The six years before you were born, the doctor slapped your mom. Good. Wait, <laughs> you, you're fine with the doctor slapping your mom? No, I, I was saying good because the, the, the toss and the rebound worked, and he didn't even see a fucking wall there, so it's like, that was good. Well, I mean, there wasn't a whole lot that they could do. Oh, uh, Squirt? That's the name of the boss of this area? Squirt? Yep. <laughs> yep. That's wop 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 wet ass pussy. Please tell me it's oh it's a crab. I thought it was gonna be a cat. Damn it's it. it is not a crab. What the fuck are you talking about? Oops. Wait, is it a snail? No, it's a fucking that face in the background. It looks I wanna like thank it. you for putting me back in my snail shell. Snail shell. 
Oh, I see Jace is a man of culture as well. Yes. Oh. Okay, so when it's when it starts to fucking spin that yeah, whole you gotta... bullshit, you gotta jump with it like a jump rope. A jump rope. Obviously. Stop, jump stop, 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 stop. Good, good job. Good boy. In it. Oh, there we go. We found a we found a workaround. Good job, Mike. I'm proud of you. Pizza? Alrighty. Well, pizza time, boys. <sighs> Look, if I had some spare slices, I would give them to you. Yeah, there's there's a reason why this is like the weakest Donkey Kong country. It's well, not just the trading quests and shit. More like Most Donkey Strong Country. <laughs> the friggin' the living barrel, the weird robot, this thing. Oh, this is this is the weirdest fucking boss fight I've ever seen. In a Donkey Kong Country game, then. Are you hurting him? Yes. No? No. Oh. That, that fucking, that mouth. What that mouth is do? Just I don't want to know what that mount does. Thank you very much. It's squirt. Hey, there's your other jet ski. Now I have jet skis. Now, now, now you can uh, now you can go up waterfalls. Hurrah! <clears throat> Sweet dude. I'm gonna go do that right now. My dreams of rhythm and dancing. So one of the funny things you can do too uh, early on, motorboat, is uh, you can unlock like the final area in the game very early on in the game by like just driving in circles around. Uh... So you can you can cheese the game to get it to end early. Uh. Well, you can you can cheese the game to get into the end area, but you can't actually like get to the ending early. Oh, I see. Undercover Jesus. Cove. Undercover of the night. Oh, this, this kitty carrot is so small. So small. Yeah, they only get longer, too. I remember the last one was, like, freaking impossibly long. Yeah. Hurrah. doodly doo 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 doodly doo doo Glenn Powell plays football for Oregon Ducks in new TV series. Eh, six out of ten. Hope his personality is like a 50 out of ten. Yeah, I think it has to do with going in circles around that uh, shallow thing in the middle. Hold on, there's a there's a bear house down here. Mm, bear. <laughs> bear. Bramble's Bungalow. Uh, oh, yeah, you gotta give him uh, a flower. I gotta find a flower. Uh, I think uh, I think you get the flower from uh, the first bear. That's possible. Let's go. 
All right, bizarre. No, he's got the uh, mirror. I might as well get it. Oh, it's fifty coins. Uh, it's fifty coins. Yeah. Never mind. Come Fuck. on back in, you fuckers. Hmm. Oh my god, that's good. Oh, okay, yeah. Okay, so go left. Okay. Okay, so if you you should be able to like go north from there, like from where that guy's like oh the bungalow. You should be able to like. Nope. Maybe not. Oh. Okay, never mind. Um, then I guess it's. Uh, Oh, no, no, it's uh, up top at the uh, barter swap shop, I think. Which you're not going to be able to get to until... Uh, until I've beaten this world, right? Yeah, and uh, you're going to have to uh, give him the mirror. I see. Because uh, he's... It's, uh, I'm, I'm looking at a file that I've already beaten, and he's like... I thought you have to break the mirror for bad luck or something weird like that. So. Now break your hymen for good luck. Uh, oh, look at me. This is to me again as soon as I sold that mirror. Um. Oh, um. When you get an emotional support axolotl, but it keeps running away. Aw. Yes, uh, axolotl. Get off of the Korean barbecue flavored chips. Hadoop doop, it's the mug up, yeah! Looking at cute shit. I mean, I'm uh, clearly still looking at you, but I'm also looking at cute shit. Okay, no need to be redundant. Proud of you. You didn't take the piss out of yourself once. I am so proud of you. What are you talking about? <laughs> Pretty sure I've called myself fat at least three times during this record session. <laughs> you did, but not just now. She could have been like, can you look at your weep shit later and just focus on, like, the game, please? Um. Despite the fact that I don't know shit for dick about any of the Donkey oh, Kong shit. games other than... What? Uh, oh, yeah, look, yeah. he's lose it. Mojos, pornos, ay, 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 ay. Hmm. Run, 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 run. Nope. Fuck. Nope. That didn't work. Not, not right. Fuck. Fuck. How do... I Can you know. roll it up the wall? No. Why would I be able to defy gravity? <laughs> Look, it was just a question. Like I said, I haven't played this game. I know you can bounce shit. I know you can lightly tap toss it, but I didn't know if you could like roll it up the wall uh, and toss shit. All right, Jace, how Wait, the fuck am I supposed to get this one? Okay. Uh... Is, the, is the baby faster when he rolls? I don't know. Maybe. Try that. Nope. No. Nope. Oh, I, dreamed of a I thought if you were able to like fucking throw it up against the wall and get a good head start as the baby that you can roll to a point where he's distracted. 
Evidently not. No. I'm that but a bitch. I'm trying to find whereabouts in the video uh, the DK coin is. Wouldn't be very far in. I'm not to the halfway point yet. But I'm sad. First bonus area. What the hell? I'm gonna assume something crazy caught your attention. Literally just threw it up from underneath as Kitty Kong. Really? Yep. Okay, give me a barrel. <laughs> give me a barrel. Uh, that did not work. No, like, while he's looking that way, throw it. No, that did not work. He, he did it, like, in a jump and kind of... No. I don't know how this guy did it. He freaking just all in one move. I don't know how you did it, but I know you was dead. What? I I call I call shenanigans because it was like kind of speed runny the way it looked. I was like, what the hell? I did it. Shit. Yes. <laughs> okay then. <laughs> yes. All right. Yeah. That's, that's my boy. Well, there you go. It is doable then. I guess. That's really stupid, but all right. <laughs> Whatever. I'm not going to complain. I got it now. The thing is, like, there is a strategy guide for this game that explains how to do that. And it is a lot more complicated than that. Find the coin, yeah. you big boy. Yeah. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> Staples. And I think I just finished like... the level at this point. Is that a dick? Yes. Oh, it's oh, of course it's a dick. It's Kanye West. Never mind. That's the biggest dick. Yeah, we don't need that dick. I mean, unless, I unless, you're, unless you're Kim Kardashian. Well, I should. I kind of take it back. I missed the Kanye from like before 2006, but before he went before he like... went butt fucking insane. Oh, oh, oh! And speaking of oh, butt fuck, oh. um, uh, oh, Jace, that is a spicy AirPod holder. You're an AirPod. Wait. Which I'm in your ear and keep you in, keep you in pugs. Mm. Pizza. 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 It's kind of a unique concept. Junpei has a hat bone. Yeah, he does. Fist bones connected. Go ahead. Fist bones connected to the penis bone. Right. <laughs> Only jerk and all. Bone. Yeah, the fist bones connected to the penis bone when I'm jacking it. Pooping with the Lord. Ja jacking it in uh, San Diego. Jacking it. Jacking yep. it. Jacking it. Jacking it. Jacking it. My daddy taught me good. Wait. Trying to find the other bonus. Mummy, oh. mummy, mummy. Why does that skeleton inside of the spirit of Halloween have an an, an extra oh, appendage in its okay, penis? Because you touch yourself at night. You it's bastard. way the fuck down, and it's really far into the level. All right. Yeah. Oh, 
Mummy, I can't help but touch myself at night. I have to impress Miss Elizabeth in order for her to take me to the sock hog. What? What? Why what? would why what? would Miss Elizabeth be impressed by you jacking off? She's Fuck. dead. She's I dead. might not be referring to that Miss Elizabeth because that one's called Miss Elizabeth. Elizabeth. But no, this could be a different Miss Elizabeth. Whoops. I would love uh, to love you, but you like mama's boy and a little twat. I got a big fucking piece of a shit. What? You know what? I'm gonna skip the toboggan. Fuck it. No toboggan. Fuck a toboggan. Ooh. Yeah. I don't need the goddamn motherfucking thing. Fuck a toboggan. Tuck a toboggan. Fuck a toboggan. Fuck a toboggan. Fuck a Fuck a toferkey. Fuck a to What? <laughs> to the world, bitches. Don't fuck a toferkey. That'd be gross. A tur don't you mean a turducken? No, toferkey. It's a tofu, tofu turkey. Okay. okay. Hey, it's snowing. Goodbye, bitrate. Oh, never mind. It's back. <laughs> Actually, it's not so bad these days. Compression's a lot different now than it used to be. Okay, Jace has a burp. Maybe Dane. Well, I don't know. Jace, I has a burp. Dane, Is that what you said? No, I said I have a question. That's not what it sounded like. You so, said sounded like you said I have a burp. But I have a question. So we know that, like, as of last year, Henry Kissinger died. I keep seeing memes of like Henry Kissinger in hell and Anthony Bourdain about ready to beat the fuck out of him. Why is that? I'm trying to understand. Why are you asking me that? Of all the because questions in the world. I mean, I don't know either. Fuck. I, I missed two stars. Just... Consarn it. No, I'm... Oh. No, I oh. Man, it put me in the fucking toboggan. I hate put me in the that. friend zone. Put me in the tucking for boggin. All right, I guess I gotta do the rest of this level as the toboggan. Oh, uh, I found an article about it. Well, I found a shardicle. Of course you would. God damn it, I missed the go. stars again. She's <laughs> gonna die and come back. Anthony Bourdain always wanted to punch Henry Kissinger over Cambodia. Once you've been to Cambodia, Why? you'll wow. never want to stop beating Henry Kissinger to death with your bare hands. That's a weird place to choose to beat beat up Henry Kissinger. Can he just do it here in America? I think Henry wow. Kissinger did some really bad shit in Cambodia. Uh, why do I gotta I get? Why do I gotta get it. into a plane and then specifically fly over the country of Cambodia just to kick Henry Kissinger's ass? <laughs> what? They're both dead. It doesn't. Really well, technically, that means uh, that... Bourdain pointed out in his book, A Cook's Tour, that Kissinger was one of the key policymakers responsible for the U.S. bombing of Cambodia and Laos towards the end of the Vietnam War. And the bombing resulted in hundreds of thousands of deaths in the affected countries. Correct. And, and oh. thus, he was trying to get New York restaurants to ban Kissinger. Okay. Easy DK coin. That makes sense. He has a personal beef with Kissinger. That's going to do it for this edition of Backseat Gamer. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe and be sure to hit the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Dane Ford, June, Jason Amherst, and Ashton Miller, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time on Backseat Gamer. Good night, everybody. Good night.